Hawaii Lupa. Eh? Hawaii Lupa. We have a problem. Eh? We have a problem. So I've just got in the studio here. We've got AJ here. We've got Ace. We're about to go live. This is going to be good. I think we're doing some challenges with some boxing gloves. Look at these. The belts are in the place. The belts look even seconds. better in person. All right, we're going on. 20 seconds, 20 seconds. Right, right so we're all done. Just leaving now. Um, I heard that Barty Creeps was somewhere around here floating about. I wanted to see him just before I went, but there he is. Knock, knock. Uh, oh, hi there, it's Barty Creeps. Currently preparing for tonight's report, just being interrupted by the world's second largest forehead, Jeremy Lynch. What do you mean? Please, my forehead's my bro, my forehead's normal. <laughs> now I've been Barty Crease, BBC News. <laughs> you know what? I've got a lot of respect for Jeremy's consistency because I've been trying to upload one today and honestly, I might as well be training for a 15k in Kenya. It's That's hard, it's, it's hard, it's hard. Very difficult. Oh, at this rate, I wouldn't be surprised if you finish Avatar 2 before <laughs> bloody James Bader. Bro, you've touched on a real important one. Consistency <laughs> is key. key and it's so hard to stay consistent and keep the quality up and your your content this guy doesn't miss if he posts everyone knows it's going to be a banger and yeah. to keep up that um quality and be consistent you have to be a, li a literal savage yeah when, when the camera stops rolling i'll give you the fiver cool no problem yeah but thanks jeremy so much for those kind words straight from the heart no problem, no problem. Uh, that's a real friendship right there so 20 a paper uh, okay. off the books off the books <laughs> Brother, pleasure. Good to see you, brother. See you later. So current settings, just finished filming a video. This is what I'm looking like. I've got a, a toy axe in my hand. I'm sure if someone sees me, they'll call the police. I'm covered in dust. Look at that. Absolutely filthy. Fake bulletproof vest on, but we've got the content. I'm gonna go home, edit it up. It's gonna be a banging video though. Trust me on that. I don't know if anyone's ever disrespected their lubes as much as me. Look at this. These have just become my, my filming shoes. <laughs> and they are absolutely destroyed. I fell over in them the other day as well, completely scratched up the side, covered in mud. But they work so well for the content. They work so well. So they stay, the lubes stay. I need to buy a new pair for going out though, because literally I can't ever wear these out again, because. They are gone. Finished. How are you, Lupa? Eh? How are you, Lupa? We have a problem. Eh? We have a problem. <laughs> Take some in your walk Go sit down before me. I slap you in the head. Idiot. How are you, did you? So what I've been doing most mornings during lockdown is I'll wake up early. I'll go and do a run. Watch the sunrise as I'm running. Then I'll train. For the record, I'm done trying to make y'all comfortable. For the record, you ain't trying to grow any stuff for you. And then I'll come home. Say good morning to Bob. Morning, Bob. And then get into the day. Let's do a quick studio update. So if we come in here, this is the studio. Magic happens. The weekends just pop around for a studio session. Just hold fire while I do this, please, man. Just stay still. I won't be long. I'll be with you in a minute. Just, just don't move. Just don't move. <laughs> We're building this room from scratch. It's not finished yet. I do these Instagram stories where we do studio updates and show the whole process of building the room. There's been a drama. Basically, one of the dogs somehow got in here and look at this. It's chewed up the bass trap. Look at that. It's absolutely destroyed it. So this is going to have to go. 
It can't stay. I could replace it, but I took it out a few minutes ago and I actually think it looks better without it. So what I'm thinking now, instead of replacing this one, I'm actually gonna take both of them out and I think it's gonna look much better. There's gonna be more space. We call this a supersonic wall. It looks amazing as it is, but I think it's gonna look even better without these base traps here. There's no need for them. They don't, they don't serve a purpose besides covering up these wires. But I'm gonna do my cable management anyway, so this is all gonna become invisible soon. Anyway, so, they're both going and I've got the dogs to thank. I don't know which dog did it though. Let's, let's see if we can figure it out. Mila, Maxi. Mila, can I ask you a question, girl? You know the bass trap in the studio? Did you chew up? She's not giving me much. She's keeping her poker face on. She's keeping her poke. You're keeping your poke. Good girl. Good girl. Right. Let's see what Max. Let's, let's see what Max has to say for himself. I've got my suspicions. It probably was Max. Maxie. Hello, boy. Can I ask you a question? You know the bass trap in the studio. Was it you that clawed it up? I see a twitch. I see a twitch. That's a body tail if ever I saw one. You've given your game away. It was Max. It was you, boy, wasn't it? Ah! It was you. You're lucky you got that cute little face. You get away with murder. You get away with murder, don't you? He's a licker as well. Can't stop licking. Right. <laughs> right, babe. <laughs> Let's go back to the studio. So if you don't already know, the studio is where I edit most of my videos. I also play the piano. And I try and make time to practice for at least half an hour a day. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna quickly make a beat with the MPC. Now, this is a beat maker, and we're gonna give ourselves 30 seconds to try and make a banging beat. I know, it sounds impossible, but we're gonna do it. Let's go. Here. Let's see if Max eats some of this. No, don't let him. Uh, 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 uh. He's thinking about it. Oi. No. Nope. No. Oi, oi. Oi, no. <laughs> no. I don't want to touch it. Let it go, let it go, let it go. Right, come on, boy. Come on. Come on. <laughs> go on, go. What's up, guys? So today we're going to be going head to head in a hide and seek battle in the new house with a forfeit for the loser. Your own barber, so wow. quarantine is not affecting the trim. It doesn't affect the trim. How many years have you been cutting your own hair now? Maxi. Oh no! Oh, no, Maxi! No, 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 you don't no. eat the hair, Bubba boy. That's not to eat, boy. No, no, oh, no, 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 no. What are you doing, boy? Oh. No, you just eat anything. <laughs> right, you've got to go out. You've got to go out. You've got to go out, boy. Oh, Maxi, I'll come and get you in a minute. Look at this, this is mad. So this is one of the characters that I'm doing for this video. And I've just found this filter. It transforms you into a child, man. This actually looks like me when I was a kid. I can't stop looking at it, man. Look at that. <laughs> wow, technology's moving so fast, man. It's a bit scary. It's a bit, look at you and the teeth. I had teeth like this, I had these teeth. <laughs> 
Oh, my mind is blown, man. Wow. <laughs> that is mad. So the other week, me and Yanni raced our Lamborghini Urises. Let's see the football out with all his reactions. I've got a real chance on this. I've got a real chance. He may have to fight for that win. Come on. Oh, he started. He started. Oh my god, why is his car quicker than mine? I think I've, I've got him! I've got him! I've got him! Good race, but let's face it, it was the warm up for the Aventador race. That's the one that we both wanted to know who's gonna win it. So we took the Aventadors to the track for a straight out drag race to see whose car is faster once and for all. Hi guys, it's Shannon from Yanomize and I'm at Santa Pod Raceway. You might remember I teased a video of myself and Jezza. Well, today's the day. I've got my Lamborghini Aventador SB Roadster versus my old Lamborghini Aventador S, but well, that's now Jezza's car. Let's race. Yeah. 